実にたどり着くことができるのでしょうか運命よここにいでよ剣に誓う我が剣よ影に従え火力全開判決を下す Alright, what is going on, guys? My mom's back again, coming to you with the news on the adjustments to Zong Li. Bro, okay, this is what we've been waiting for. I heard that his changes were really good. Let's just get right into it. Okay, so everyone has been waiting since the announcement of Zong Li will enter the 1.3 test server. Now, for those that remember this picture from z e n y e t it shows Paimon looking like all buff, and then the traveler showing, yo, Zong Li, come right this way, my boy, we got work to do. And、uh, it looks like we finally got confirmation that he is indeed getting buffed, which is really, really, really nice. And、uh, yeah, so we are well aware of everyone's love and attention to Zhang Li and their concern for future changes. We also understand that everyone is eager to know about Zhang Li's adjustments. We are very sorry for the delay of this adjustment announcement during this period of time by collating and Summarizing the tens of thousands of feedbacks from the travelers inside and outside of the game, we found that everyone's feedback mainly focused on Zhang Li's actual combat intensity. Now, and oh, the use of skills and rock element construction system. Now, I don't think it's anyone's surprise about the disappointment that a lot of people got with Zhang Li. I personally thought that he was just fine until I actually started like gearing him up and realized, yo, this guy deals absolutely zero damage outside of his ultimate, which is kind of annoying when you're like trying to, let's、like, say you're playing co op, right? Not every single time you're playing co op, you're going to be around all your friends. And trying to take down little enemies is such a pain in the ass. So, like, it's, it, it's just jarring seeing like how little damage you actually do unless you get your ultimate. So, seeing the changes here is going to be really, really, really good. I hear that his changes are awesome. So, yeah. Combining the actual data performance in the game after multiple rounds of discussion by the development team, we formulated the first version of the adjustment plan. These adjustments will be made in the 1.3 test server at the earliest. Meeting with travelers participating in the test, the cur currently proposed Adjustments are shown below involving Zhang Li's talent enhancement, skill and feel, and mechanism optimization. Rock element resonance mechanism. Oh, so they're changing the resonance too. And rock element shield balance adjustments. During the 1.3 test, we will continue to observe the data performance of the above adjustments in the test server, as well as the feedback of the test travelers, and hope that these adjustments can bring effective. Ex、uh, Effective experience improvements to everyone. Now, keep in mind that this is tra being translated from,、uh, I believe, Chinese. So、uh, keep in mind that、uh, some of the translations are going to be a little bit jarring to understand, but、uh, I mean, like, it, it's Google Translate, right? It is what it is.、Uh, one thing to note, however, that this is 1.3 testing, which means that this won't be out for at the very least another six to like seven, eight weeks. All right. So、uh, just keep that in mind for those that are interested in summoning for Zhang Li. Um, he's like the changes aren't going to be affecting him until later. All right, so during the test, we will continue to observe the data performance、uh, in the test server as well as the feedback of the test travelers and hope that these adjustments can bring effective experience. Of course, before all related changes are officially launched, we will also synchronize the final adjustment plan with you. That's awesome. Currently adjusted constant.、Uh, Currently adjusted content non final version. For the role of Zong Li, the, an adjustment of the inherent talent cooking gold and jade.、Um, I think this is just like for cooking, I suppose,、uh, not really that big a deal.、Uh, the damage caused by the, okay, the original effect. The damage caused by the star, or the constellation, is increased by 33% of the upper limit, your max HP of Zong Li's life. So just straight up, star will be constellation, upper limit. Of Zhang Li's life means Zhang Li's max HP. Okay, so adjusted effect. Based on the upper limit of health, the damage caused by Zhang Li's following attacks is increased. Normal attack, heavy blow, and falling attack damage increase value 1.39% of the upper limit of health. Now, that is interesting. Now, exactly how this is going to be completely worded is going to be a little tricky, but the, pretty much what this means is. His normal attacks, his heavy blow, like charge attack, and his plunge attack will be scaled to his max health, which means that you are actually going to want to build him as a max HP build instead of just attack percent of、uh, physical damage. And if you can get HP, if you can get crit damage, crit health, crit, I mean crit rate or whatever, then you, like, so be it.、Uh, this looks like this is going to want you to actually go for HP percent gear, which is pretty cool. Uh, I, mean, I mean, it could be good or bad depending on how you guys have been building Zhang Li、uh, since then. I personally haven't been farming anything for him because I wanted to make sure, like, ever since we got that screenshot on Twitter, I was like, I, I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna wait 
and then I'll be ready when the time comes. Yeah. The Rock Ridge Resonance and uh, the Rock Ridge Resonance damage and long press damage increase in the center of the Earth 1.9% of the upper limit of health. So this is gonna scale according to your HP as well. Um, oh, the damage increase is nutty though. Look at this. All right, so zooming in, you'll see uh, this is probably going to be before you're dealing like 100, like 85 to like 440, and this is hitting for like 200 to like 800, 997 over there. Okay, oh, there was a 12. Wait, was that a 1256? Boom. Okay, yeah. So he's definitely hitting significantly harder than before. That's going to be dope. Uh, going into his uh, actual E ability. You'll see that the resin, the resonate of the geo structure is actually hitting for more damage as well. The initial hits for 223 versus 900, which is dope, and then the pulse 922 to 446. Okay, so overall, uh, he's definitely going to be hitting a lot harder. Um, I, we don't know how well geared these Zonglis are, so I mean, I guess take all this with a grain of salt. Just understand that everything is going to be scaling with his health now, which is awesome. Constellation damage increase 33% of max HP. Uh, as well as all these new bonuses so like the original effect is being kept in place as well as the uh, normal attack damage charge attack plunge attack and his resonance with his actual E ability that's awesome okay going into the original effect causes nearby rock elements to erupt causing the following effects form form oh I think this is the hold form a uh, Jade Zhang shield the damage absorption benefit from Zhongli's upper limit of life, his max HP, and 250% absorption effect on the damage of the rock. Inflict damage to the area of rock elements. If there is a target with rock element nearby, it will consume a large amount of rock element of at most two targets. This effect does not cause harm. Okay, this is a, the break, and this is a... I think this is what you use to like farm. Um, the adjusted effect, however, is going to be here. If the number of ridges does not reach the upper limit create ridges now I'm, I'll be real with you I don't know exactly 100% what that actually means a uh, form a jade shield the damage absorption benefit from Zhongli's max HP okay and 150% absorption effect for all elemental damage and physical damage so the 250% absorption effect on the damage of the rock element was literally just for the geo element. This is going to be for all elements as well as physical damage. That's kind of nutty. Uh, inflict damage to areas and then everything else is like unchanged. Okay, uh, let's uh, open this one. Oh, okay. So I think that this is going to be the geo resonance. This is the re geo re resonance thing, right? Mm, I might be wrong. Uh, let's see. The adjustment of the rock element. Never mind. It, it is okay. <laughs> rock of firmness. Um, pretty much you'll see that he actually is resistant to the attack. There, like, so it gives him more opportunity to actually put up his shield. Over here, you see him without it. That means that he's getting smacked up like a hoe. Okay. The original effect improved ability to resist interruption when protected by a shield the damage done is increased by 15% <laughs> Okay, <laughs> that is what it used to be. The shield is powerfully increased by 15% Okay, in addition when the character is under the protection of the shield. Ah, okay. There we go Improved ability to resist interruption when protected by a shield the damage done is increased by 15% now It said attack if I remember correctly in the actual game. Give me one second. Hopefully they haven't changed it just yet. Here it is. Uh, increased attack damage by 15%. Okay, so it, it, it does say damage in particular. That's good. All right. Uh, the shield is powerfully increased by 15%. In addition, when the character is under the protection of the shield, it has the following characteristics. The damage caused is increased by 15%. When the... Increases attack damage. Okay. I, I just want to make sure the wording is right. I don't want to give misinformation. Uh, when the character causes damage to the enemy, it will reduce the <laughs> the enemy's rock element resistance by 20% for 15 seconds. <sighs> That's a big buff. You're like Ningguang and Zhong Li are gonna go like damn. Okay, like they were already really good together. This is nasty. <laughs> when the character causes damage to the enemy. 
Um, if the wording is right here, that means that you don't have to hit them with Geo. You just have to hit them. <laughs> whether it be with your structure, whether it be with your, like, your, like, maybe you sneeze on them, give them some COVID. Like, whatever you do, you will reduce their rock elemental resistance by 20%. That is, that is dope. That is hella dope. And this applies to everyone on your team. So say you're running solo and you have two Geo units on your team and then like Tartalia and Deluke or something. If you smack them with Tartalia, this should apply the enemy's rock elemental resistance down by 20% as well. So that's pretty that's pretty sick. I like that. Um, okay, so balance adjustment of rock elemental shield. The rock elemental shield has been adjusted from 250 absorption effect of rock elemental damage, which like there's not many rock element enemies anyways unfortunately uh to 150 percent absorption effect on all elemental damage and physical damage so the shield is effectively weaker however it has a lot more coverage which i think is actually much 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 better like imagine you're like facing a bunch of enemies and you literally are only covered by rock like you're only protected by rock which was really i mean it made sense but it it it, it wasn't um it just wasn't ideal, right? Like, you, you don't see me, like, playing with knives and stuff like that, and then I just bring out a bazooka and, I, and expect to know how to use the bazooka. All right, that's probably a bad analogy, but whatever. Okay, uh, the affected effects include Zongli Elemental Warfare, additional Rock Elemental Shield, Noelle's Shield, uh, pick up the Rock Elemental Shield from Rock Crystals dropped by the Baby Rock Dragon. Oh, okay. Uh, that's the uh, the little hilly troll type thing. Uh, this adjustment is... N not the hilly troll. Damn it, I forgot what this, the stupid thing is called, dude. It, it's such a weird name. The little hatchlings. Uh, I, I forget what they're, they're actually fully called. Uh, this adjustment is not only to improve the experience of Zong Li's single character, but we also hope to better convey to everyone the advantages of the Rock Element gameplay system and Shield gameplay system closely related to Zong Li. Not only Zong Li itself, but also for the long-term travelers who have worked hard on these strategic systems, provide a better gaming experience overall. Precisely, because the expected goal is higher than a simple roll adjustment, we must be cautious. Rather than hurriedly releasing a general adjustment direction, we hope to give travelers a detailed plan. So keep in mind, this is not all 100% going to come into the game as is. They're going to be testing it and making sure that it's good and uh, healthy for the game because if they just break the game even further, then they're going to have to correct it again. And um, like, I get that a lot of people are like upset that Zong Li wasn't as strong as he was in the closed beta, but like he wasn't really nerfed. You can't nerf something that was never out to begin with, technically. Like, like, like if you're not actually supposed to be playing the game, like you're just, you sign an NDA when you, well, not all the time you sign the NDA, but like more often than not, you're told don't leak this stuff because it's not finished. Like, if I tell people, yo, bro, like, like, just, uh, what's a perfect example, bro? What's a perfect example? Like, imagine if I have an idea, right? And, like, the idea is so far-fetched, it's so awesome, and everyone is so excited about it. But I told everyone, I'm like, this is what we want to do, but, like, it, it, we're currently in closed beta, we can't promise that this is what it's gonna be when it comes out. And then you buy it, yo, the Ouya! Literally the freaking Ouya! Bro, look, this is, this is closed beta test at its prime bro and y'all remember what happened to this thing <laughs> yo say goodbye bro say goodbye so like i mean I, I i get why people were disappointed but like when you take everything like you gotta take closed beta stuff with a grain of salt same thing with with zhao i'm sure zhao's not gonna be as crazy op as he was in the beta but she should be reasonably strong like what, what are the other characters zhang ling like she's still really good like zong li is still really like zong li is still really good it's just he can't he hits like a potato like he just hits like a potato unless he uses his ultimate which don't get me wrong his ultimate's dope but like everything else is is, is, is really mediocre damage uh, he's literally just a support and it's kind of funny considering that he's supposed to be like the archon god of them all like literally this man threw spears that made mountains <laughs> like come on all right so uh let's see here uh, we sincerely hope that Zong Li can become a favorite partner of Travelers, and we also hope that through this role, Travelers can experience some different gameplays and gain a richer game experience. 1.3, the qualifications for the test server will be issued in the near future. Here, we also urge Travelers who have obtained the test qualifications during the test experience, if you have any suggestions and feedback on the above adjustments, we will not hesitate to put forward to us in the game. In addition, if Travelers have feedback or complaints about other test content, they can also give us feedback in the game. We will 
will definitely read carefully one by one and work hard to adjust and optimize the game to live up to everyone's expectations. This is like one thing that I really like about Mahoyo, because they could have literally like just been like, um, yeah, I mean this is on Lee, like not every character is gonna be a banger, you know, and then they go out of their way to make sure that people are satisfied with what they paid for. Like how many times have we like like for for those that play gacha games because i know that this game is new to some people that have never even played gacha games but how many times have you pulled a character and then you're like well he's pretty good not as good as i expected him to be but eh, he's pretty good and and that happens literally all the time like not every single character is going to be broken so i mean i personally understood why there was like a lot of backlash but I personally understood why Zhong Li wasn't as broken as people expected him to be. Um, this though, like, the fact that they're actually communicating and telling us this, like, we could have gotten this from leaks, right? We could have gotten this from leaks and everyone would have had to take it with a grain of salt. Like, this is this is our plan. But no, they're, they're actually going out of their way to say, yo, this is our plan. Just keep in mind, like, that we are making changes and we hope that you appreciate that we are being transparent. And I think that transparency in a company that, especially a gacha game, is very... What's the word I'm looking for? It's very rare. It's, it's very rare that there's transparency when it comes to these gacha games. Uh, taking, taking, to, taking into account like something like uh, BBS, Naruto Blazing, Dokkan, like literally any gacha game, Fate Grand Order. Like, so, I, I mean, this is this is pretty dope. It's pretty dope. But I'm going to leave it at that. You guys, grind I'll catch up with him. Stay blessed. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'm sorry that this took longer than it, than, than, than I expected. Um, it, It's really cool. Like, I'm actually really excited. Because he's, to me, he looked like he was meant to be a bruiser. Like, you build him with max HP. You use your ultimate. But it's weird that none of his other attacks scaled with his HP. So it's awesome that they're changing it to do that. So um, he looks. it looks like Zhong Li will effectively be now a bruiser. <laughs> That's dope. But I'm going to leave it at that. Stay blessed, y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace, y'all. <laughs>